How's it going? Uh, it's it's good. Wow, you got a lot of happening. Yeah, I know. Very exciting. I am starving. Please be careful. That's really very oh, hot. Oh, hot, hot, hot. Yeah. Hot. Yep. Jesus. Hey, hun. Uh, you should really get ready. Okay. Oh, uh, you look great. Thank you. You got a lot of nice stuff. You got pizza. Yeah, yeah, all kinds of stuff. Uh, Gary. Yeah. Oh, oh, come on, really? Yeah, yeah, you got three lemons. What my baby wants, my baby gets. You know that. Yeah, but I want a twelve. You know, baby wanted twelve. Why would you want twelve lemons? Because I'm making a twelve lemon centerpiece. Oh, so no one is actually even eating them. They're just show lemons. Yeah, they're just show lemons, shown in the center of the table. Glad you find that amusing. But I cannot fill a vase with three lemons. Well, why can't you use um, uh, like maybe a drinking glass? I'm not gonna use a drinking. Well, you could have a smaller uh, version of the centerpiece. No, I'm not going to use a drinking glass for our centerpiece, Gary. You know what? I got an idea. Why don't we go and scratch the centerpiece idea all together? Because the chicken that burned my mouth could maybe use a little bit of lemon on top of it. So guess what? Now we made a better meal versus something visually look nice to look at. Yeah, you know what? What are what are you doing? What's happening here? What are you doing? What, Gary? What are you doing? I had such a long day on the bus. I need a little downtime. My feet are killing me. <laughs> okay. Oh boy. You know, my feet are killing too. I worked all day. I went to the market. I cleaned the entire condo. And then I've been cooking for the last three hours. Just go help set the table. Sweetheart? What? You've done such a great job already. Don't you want to finish it yourself and have that person power, that accomplishment? Set the table! Listen to me. Do you think that when Michelangelo, right, was painting the 16th chapel that he said, hey guys, I did pretty good on for the first 15 chapels, but why don't you help me design this one? Then maybe you could uh, give me a brush and you guys could grab brushes and we could all make a great chapel. Nuh-uh. No, he didn't. And you don't want to know what the results were? A masterpiece. You know, I really don't have time for this. First off, it's the Sistine Chapel, not the 16th. And I bet when Michelangelo asked for 12 brushes, they didn't bring him three. Uh, yeah, okay. All the talking is really starting to drain me and, and for distracting me. And I know I'm going to have to watch the highlights later to see what I miss here. Honey, look, Gary, just go take a shower. But downtimes are important. Downtimes are important. Look, this is what I don't want to have happen. I don't want the doorbell to ring, and I'm then forced to answer the door, entertain people, and I'm still cooking dinner. Yeah? OK? You're absolutely right. Let's do that. The second this inning is over, that's one out already. Gary, they're going to be here in 20 minutes. Baby, have you ever seen a share of mine take more than four minutes? Yes, I have. Common. Great, they're here. <laughs> Table's not set, dinner's not ready. Would you please just let my parents in? I gotta jump in the shower. What? I gotta do it. <sighs> Gary. Gary! I'm starving. Oh, please be careful. That's really very hot. <sighs> what? <sighs> yeah. <sighs> Jesus. Hey, hun, you should really get ready, okay? Oh, look at you. You look great. Oh, thank you. You got a lot of nice stuff here. You got pizza. Uh-huh. All kinds of stuff. Gary. Yeah? Oh, come on. Really? You only got three lemons. What my baby wants. My baby gets, you know that. Yeah, but I wanted 12. Baby wanted 12. Why would you want 12 lemons? Because I'm making a 12 lemon centerpiece. So no one is actually even eating them. They're just show lemons. Yeah, they're just show lemons, shown in the center of the table. I'm glad you find that amusing, but I cannot fill a vase with three lemons. Uh, can't you just use, like, maybe a drinking glass? I'm not going to use a drinking... <laughs> well, 
you could have a smaller um, version of the centerpiece. No, I'm not going to use a drinking glass for our centerpiece. You know what? I got an idea. Why don't we go and scratch the centerpiece idea all together? Because the chicken that burned my mouth could maybe use a little bit of lemon on top of it. So guess what? Now we made a better meal versus something visually nice to look at. What? What are you doing? What's happening here? What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> I had such a long day on the bus. I need a little downtime. My feet are killing me. Gary, come on. My feet are killing me too. I worked all day. I went to the market. I cleaned this entire congo condo. And then I've been cooking for the last three hours. Come on, help set the table. Sweetheart. What? You've done such a great job on it. Don't you want to finish it yourself and have that first empower that accomplishment? Set the table. Okay. Listen, do you think that when Michael Angelo was painting the 16th chapel, they said, hey guys, I did a pretty good on the first 15 chapels. Why don't you help me design this one? Then maybe you could uh, give me a brush and you guys could grab brushes and we could all make a great chapel. No, uh, no, he didn't. And do you want to know what the results were? A masterpiece. It was the Sistine Chapel, not the 16th. And I bet when Michelangelo asked for 12 brushes, they didn't bring him three. Yeah, okay. All the talking is really starting to drain. And now I'm going to have to watch the highlights later to see what I missed. Honey, look, Gary, please just set the table. Down times are important. Down times are important. This is what I don't want to have happen. I don't want the doorbell to ring. I'm then forced to answer the door and entertain people and I'm still cooking dinner. Okay? You're absolutely right. Let's do that. The second this inning is over, there's, there's one out already. Gary, they're going to be here in 20 minutes. Baby, have you ever seen a shower of mine take more than four minutes? Yes, I have. Common. Great, now they're here. <laughs> Table's not set. Dinner's not ready. Would you please just let my parents in? I gotta jump in the shower. What? I gotta do it. Gary! Gary! Awesome. I loved it. Loved it. Um, so, James, I want you to be... You're the smooth talker. Somehow you always get away with never helping, you know, you, you somehow manage to get out of, of doing the dishes, all this stuff, like, you're a smooth talker. Everything is, everything that comes out of your mouth is exactly how you planned it. You're focused, you, you're, you're in that, in that place. I want this to get to a climax. So the part where you mentioned Michelangelo, I want you to kind of like snap a little bit to break that mold of the smooth talker, the always like calm, cool, collected guy, then when she snaps back, that's when you go back to smooth talker. Does that make sense? Sure. Okay. Just just be as smooth as you can be, my guy. You already got that down to a T. And then Kendra, you're you're always trying to appeal to him. No matter what, no matter what he does, he always seems to get away with with not helping, you know. You don't really get frustrated, you more just try to get him, try to appeal to him more. You always are, have this like bubbliness to you, which you already kind of have, but it works really well. Um, and no matter what, like I told him, he always gets out of it. So you're really trying, this is like finally culminating, he's about to meet your mom and dad. You gotta, you gotta try to get him somehow, he still gets out of it. Exactly, you're totally on it. All right, guys, that's all I got. That's great, great direction. And in five, four, three, two, action. Hey, honey. Hi. How's it going? Oh, uh, it's going good. Wow, you got a lot happening here. I know, very exciting. I'm starving. Oh, mm, be careful, that's really very hot. Hot, hot. Honey, yeah, mm-hmm. 
Hey, hon, you should, um, you should really get ready, okay? You look great, by the way. Thank you. A lot of nice stuff going here. You got pizza. Huh, yeah, all kinds of stuff. Gary. Yeah? Oh, come on, really? You got three lemons. What my baby wants. My baby gets, you know that? Yeah, but I wanted 12. Baby wanted 12. Why would you want 12 lemons? Because I'm making a 12 lemon centerpiece. So no one's actually even eating them. They're just show lemons. Yeah, they're just show lemons shown in the center of the table. I'm really glad you find that amusing. But I cannot fill a vase with three lemons. Well, can you just use uh, like uh, maybe a drinking glass? I'm not going to use a drinking glass. Uh, you could have a smaller version of the centerpiece. No, I'm not going to use a drinking glass for a centerpiece. You know what? I got an idea. Why don't we go and scratch the centerpiece idea all together? Because the chicken that burned my mouth could maybe use a little bit of lemon on top of it. So guess what? Now we made a better meal versus something visually nice to look at. What are, what are you doing? What's happening here? What are you doing? Gary, what are you doing? See, I had such a long day on the bus. I need a little downtime. My feet are killing me. Gary, come on. My feet are killing me too. I worked all day. I went to the market. I cleaned the entire condo, and then I've been cooking for the last three hours. Please, just help set the table. Sweetheart. What? You've done such a great job on it. Don't you want to finish it yourself and have that person power, that accomplishment? Set the table. Okay, listen to me. Do you think that when Michelangelo was painting the 16th chapel, he said, hey guys, I did a pretty good on the first 15 chapels. Why don't you design this one? Then maybe you could uh, give me a brush and you guys could grab brushes and we could all make a great chapel. Now, uh he didn't say that. And do you know what, do you wanna know what the results were? A uh, masterpiece. Okay, uh, mm, um, it's the Sistine Chapel, not the 16th. And I bet when Michelangelo asked for 12 brushes, they didn't bring him three. Yeah, okay. All the talking is really starting to drain me. And now I'm going to have to watch the highlights later to see what I can see. Honey, look, Gary, just go take a shower. Down times are important. Down times are important. This is what I don't want to have happen. I don't want the doorbell to ring. I'm then forced to answer the door and entertain people and I'm still cooking dinner. Yeah. Okay. You're absolutely right. Let's do that. The second this inning is over, then wait, look, one's out order. Gary, they're gonna be here in 20 minutes. Baby, have you ever seen a shower line take more than four minutes? <laughs> yes, I have. Common. Great, they're here. Table's not set. Dinner's not ready. Would you please just let my parents in? I gotta jump in the shower. What? I got to do it. Gary, Gary, Gary!